Stop dealing with men that try to match your energy. You will have the worst relationship with them because as a man, you have to understand that you cannot do what women do. Getting mad because I'm mad and then treat me like I got a problem with me without knowing if I have a problem with you is very womanly. All right, so fellas, um, first and foremost, I'm a big advocate of not letting women tell you what the hell a real man is. But in this case right now, in this video, in the way I see starting off, she's spitting facts. Men, you cannot match the energy of a woman. The minute that you start matching the energy of a woman is the minute that you lose control of the fucking relationship. You lose the power dynamic. And as men, we have to be in power in the fucking relationship. We have to be the leaders, the guy. We have to be uh, the the, uh, the protectors, the ones that's guiding them. We have to be that. So if we match her energy, we both just gonna just be moving by the goddamn wherever the wind take the goddamn relationship you should already know where the relationship is going you should already know how you want the relationship to be conducted but i'm gonna let her keep going i'm gonna let her keep going i'm gonna let her rock out we're gonna talk at the end probably not answering calls on purpose because i missed your call on accident womanly trying to hurt or destroy me mentally physically and emotionally whenever there's an issue with us womanly as a man your job is to lead and be firm on what you feel say it like it is keep a woman's emotions in order or let her be not match energy some of y'all men ain't grow with a good father in these shows. You don't know how to be a man because you've been around too many women to the point that now you're trying to keep up with one. Mm. Free game, ladies. Mm. Mm. Now, I could be biased and be like, oh man, women shouldn't be telling men how to fucking talk to us. And we, we should be. But at the end of the day, like, I'm going to give respect to someone who's actually speaking truth, no matter if it's a woman, no matter if it's a man or whomever you know what i'm saying if they them whatever if they speaking true i'm gonna get i'm gonna give respect to it but she spat she spat nothing but facts in this shit. you know one time i was dealing with a girl right and it's not even that long ago you know one time i was dealing with a girl and she said to me she said um it's probably the realest thing she ever said i don't out of the whole damn relationship she ain't said nothing really than this she said when i get mad I don't expect you to be mad with me. And when she said that shit, man, I pondered on that shit. And I was like, damn, this motherfucker is right. She's right. I can't be getting mad because she's getting fucking mad. I start yelling because she's yelling. I have to be my own person. I have to get grounded in my own masculinity. My masculinity, my logic, my intellect is supposed to tame her emotional fucking capricious feelings and emotions. My masculinity is so- Before we keep going, I have to tell you about this attraction course that literally would change your life. I know you probably looking at this in like attraction course. All I need is money, look, status, and just to dress nice and go to the gym. But this belief right here has cost a lot of men thousands of dollars and wasted time dealing with attention whores, gold diggers, manip manipulative women, paying me for coaching, paying me thousand dollars to coach. Yes. Well, you could have just learned this in one day. Just dropped a little bit of money and learned this in one day. Most of my clients are guys with money, looks, and status, and they still have problems with women. And no, I'm not going to change you guys and try to change you and be something, make you be something that you're not. Not. All the things that I'm going to be teaching you is something that you already have locked inside of you. See, the stuff that I'm going to be teaching you is mad, profound, deep, groundbreaking game. It's going to be stuff that you've never heard before. You will never be worried about attraction ever again, and you will never have to ask me for help or any other day and coach for help. And if you think I'm capping, just look at my testimonials at the end and click the link in the description below. Post to tame her femininity. So she getting mad and she being emotional and I'm getting mad and I'm being emotional. Who's the woman in the goddamn, who's the feminine? In the Nobody knows. And now that I'm my feminine, it makes her automatically step right into her masculine. And by nature, she don't want to be in her fucking masculine. She wants to be in her feminine. For a woman to be in her feminine, she has to be comfortable. And if I'm in my femininity acting like a little bitch because she's bitching, then she can't be comfortable now. She has to step into her masculine frame. And by default, that's when the relationship goes downhill. 
when a woman gets in her masculine because she's not comfortable being in her feminine with you because she's now being with a, a feminine dude. You see how that all that shit, all of that works? And if we want to keep it on the nature side, women <clears throat> naturally programmed, hardwired to be with men who are in their masculine, men who are laid back chill. You know what I'm saying? Like when a woman is in her feminine and she starts pushing the moaning dog, you supposed to just be chilling like, yo, 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 calm down, baby girl. You know what I'm saying? You got to hit that, that, that Mac Daddy shit. Yo, 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 chill out, man. Like, she, oh my God, you fucking idiot. You ever seen that one meme where it's the cat and it's the girl and she like this and the cat just with the ball, he just laid back and shit like this, just chilling like, all right. That, that's how you, that's how you're supposed to be, especially when a woman, when a woman becomes a damn storm, you're supposed to be that mountain. That mountain that that um <clears throat> that um what's the word? That's that can stand in the damn storm. Just chilling, laying back. When I when I when I be like when girls be bringing drama and shit to me or wanna argue and be all like, what's the name? I just be just chilling sometimes. I may raise my voice a little bit, but I'm not really just screaming at the top of my damn lungs. You know what I'm saying? I'm not, you know what I'm saying? I'm not <clears throat> getting emotional. And getting in my feelings. Even girls, girls, it, it gets to the point sometimes girls be trying to say shit to hurt my feelings. And I just I just laugh. You know, I do a little giggle. You're laughing. But that's masculinity. You know what I'm saying? That lets her know that she's with a fucking man. A man that because you w- 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 with women, <clears throat> they base their whole emotion, they they base their emotions off of. Sorry, I got a lot of good shit going on. They base their emotions based off of the outside world what i mean by that is they let the outside world validate what they feel emotionally so for an example if i'm getting emotional with her i validated her damn emotions i made her know that that she was actually right in being emotional but when i'm just like when she's getting emotional she was saying i'm just looking at her i'm just like this i got a smirk on my face and i'm not getting loud and i'm like yo look shorty we'll talk when you when you when you calm down i just invalidated her emotions <clears throat> A lot of women don't like that shit. But I'm not going to harp too much on this, fellas. Um, I um, hope you got a, some gems from this, man. This your boy Zay DVE, a.k.a. Zay Double Edge. And um, if you want to skyrocket your game in 24 hours or even less, then you need to click the link in the description below and check out my ebooks, my audio programs, my courses. Because, man, there's some shit in there. If you think my free shit is good... <laughs> Man, I ain't, you missed out. But um, until next time, I'm out. Deuces. If you want to learn how to get women to sleep with you from point A to point B, a first date guide without going through years and years of trial and error, then this course is for you. Even if you are a fat, broke, old dusty, awkward version dude, a dude who doesn't think he's attractive, this course will help you out in ways that you can't even imagine. And if you're also having problems with attraction, whether you are an attractive guy or think you're not an attractive guy, then you can learn all the secret hacks of attraction that all the top 20% of men who sleep with all the women know. And you can learn how women view attraction universally by clicking the link in the description below.